3D printing is an additive manufacturing process that creates a physical object. From a digital design, there are different 3D printing technologies and materials. We can print a digital model like plastic, metal, resin, nylon etc. but all are based on the same principle. A digital model is turned into a solid three-dimensional physical object by adding material layer by layer. Now we know about 3D printers but we don't know how it works. Every 3D print starts as a digital 3D design file, like a blueprint for a physical object. Trying to print without a design file is like trying to print a document on a sheet of paper without a text file. This design file is sliced into thin layers by using slicer software, which is converted to G-code also known as geometrical code. Then sent to the 3D printer to follow those geometrical patterns and make the desired design. Printing technology varies from machine to machine, starting from desktop printers that melt a plastic material and lay it down onto a print platform to large industrial machines that use a laser to selectively melt metal powder at high temperatures. The printing can take hours to complete depending on the size, material and the printed objects are often post-processed to reach the desired finish. 3D printing seems to be new technology, but an actual started arising from 1980. This took a long way to develop and come into the form of today. The first 3D printing attempts are granted to Dr. Kodama for his development of a rapid prototyping technique in 1980. He was the first to describe a layer-by-layer -layer approach for manufacturing, creating an ancestor for SLA a photosensitive resin was polymerized by a UV light. Four years later, a French team of engineers was interested in the stereolithography but abandoned due to a lack of business perspective. In the same time, Charles Hull was also interested in the technology and deposited the first patent for stereolithography in 1986. He founded the 3D Systems Corporation and a year later released the SLA-1. In 1988, at the University of Texas, Carl Descartes brought a patent for the SLS. Technology, another 3D printing technique in which powder grains are fused together locally by a laser. In 1992, the fused deposition modeling patent was issued to Stratasys, who that developed many 3D printers for both professional and individuals. Now the 3D printing is used in almost every manufacturing industries because of the reduction in cost and complexity. Thanks for watching. Kindly subscribe to my channel. Like and share this video. If you have any question please leave in the comment.